Okay, so basically half of that was a hallucination based on our guilt of what happened here. So that Huggy wasn't real. Which is fine. He was kind of cool looking though. Okay, that's locked. Uh, yeah, for though, again, I'm sure you've seen my theories, but my biggest theory is that Huggy from chapter one, the original Huggy, is not dead. Not fully dead anyway. And that we're going to see him again. And we saw this nightmare Huggy or whatever you want to call it in the in the uh, trailer, but I don't, I, I still don't think this means that we're not going to see Huggy. I really don't. I think we're going to see a living Huggy again. Yeah, see, look, Huggy agrees. <laughs> Huggy agrees with me. Hey, it's mommy. Interesting. Because we know mommy's dead, right? She's gone. So, is that why her cardboard cutout doesn't work? Hmm. Hey, look, it's baby long legs. I want a gas mask. Can I take it? Sweet. Okay, I got a gas mask now. So hopefully no more hallucinations. Although, part of me wonders if I kind of want to see more hallucinations. Uh, right, we're gonna we're gonna power on this door. Okay, we can't go through here just yet. So I'm guessing we have to drop down. But I have to check all the doors before we before we do that. Seth Jones. Okay, cool. All right, let's drop down here then. Hey, it's Carl the Cart. Do you have a... <laughs> no, all right. Do you have a, a name? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I'm dying. Gas. Oh, I see. You can actually hear cries in that, though. All right, so if you stand in the red gas, you, you just die. There's no, like, huggy chasing, like, some people were theorizing. But that's okay. Oh, I completely missed this room. Uh, is that kind of in there? I'm scratching around. I completely missed this room. Let's go and get the... Uh, I'm glad I died now. Let's go and get the gas mask. Give me. Okay, so we put on the gas mask. It's a little bit... It's a little bit trickier to see now, though. Do we have a limited time to use a gas mask? Are we going to run out of air or? That's creepy. It's like a little kid's bedroom. Look at that. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's really hard to see with the, the gas mask. Oh, wait. Nice. Good job, Carl. Good job. Also, the gas mask in the trailer was not the same gas mask that we pick up in the game. They moved it. It was on the wall here in the trailer. Interesting little detail, I guess. Well, it's interesting to me. Okay, I'm not. No, listen, 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 listen. Okay, but we just, we were already in here. So what, what, what did that accomplish? Ah, I've got to move this. Okay. Yeah, see, it was me being dumb. This is... It's very spooky when you have the gas mask on because you can't see as well. Okay. Catnap. Hello. Honestly, part of me wants to die just to see the catnap death screen. See how it holds up to Huggies but, and Mommies. Alright, there's one battery. So I guess I gotta go find another one. Hey, catnap buddy, I kind of want to, I kind of want to see your death screen. Watch out. 
Hide, hide. From catnap? Um, hello? <laughs> um, kissy? Hello? Um, Kissy's looking at the picture of the kid. Is that her or is that her friend? Kissy, what are you doing in here? Friends forever. Yeah, so I bet that was like Kissy's friend and Kissy's sad about it. Oh, that's a that's a cute little detail. Um, is this a secret? <laughs> is this a secret? Kissy doesn't even seem to care that we're here. Well, very interesting detail. I like it. I like it. <laughs> I wonder how many people are gonna miss that on their like first playthrough. I'm sure I'm gonna miss a ton too, but. Ah, here we go. We got a blue door. Yeah, see, even in the bedrooms are places that only the staff could go. Creepy. Another VHS? Give me, give me more lore. I need more lore. Where is it? Where's the tape? Give me the tape! Give me the tape! I need it, just, just, just one more tape. I just need one more, one more, one more tape. I wonder where the tape is. Is it not in here? Sorry, it, it looks suspicious. <laughs> is the tape in here? Oh, the tape's right there. Tape is it? Uh, report void. Oh, number one three two two. Oh, this is a new experiment, I think. Experiment one three two two. Report void. Okay. Subject is stable. Designated one three two two. Clear neural abnormalities. Were this was after mommy. Checkup, though highly irregular. We've pulled him from the home sweet home just before lights out to perform. What are you doing with my friend? I. What are you doing out of bed? How did you get in here? Is Kevin sick? Why did you take him Kevin. away? Kevin. Yes. Kevin is very sick. Very, very sick. But we want to make him better. Mm. But he can only Don't trust him. Better if we take him to where we can provide proper care and give him proper rest. Well, do you really think you'll be okay? I should think so. We're good at what we do, son. We paid attention in school, learned, and got our proper rest when we needed it. Just like you need it now, I should think. Come now. Let's get you on back to bed. Okay. It's been a pleasure meeting you, Joseph. And I promise you, your friend will be all right. When you see him again, he'll have never been better. So he's saying that he was sick. And I don't know if that's just a lie to, to calm Joseph down or if he actually genuinely was sick because we know that Thomas Clark supposedly had lung cancer and that's why he was put into Bron. So like, I'm wondering if they really did take these children that got sick, you know, like again, again, a lot of them were orphans, but we never, I never really considered that a lot of them could be like, What's the word? You know, like, like, uh, patients, like sick children. So I wonder if, if they literally were taking the sick ones and, and trying to make them better, you know, better bodies, right? Interesting. Okay. But uh, I still need a battery. <laughs> Can I have a battery? Coming back was a mistake. Oh, someone left that for us. Or again, are we still hallucinating? All right, so uh, after lots of searching, it turns out I'm the problem. Gamers really don't ever look up, do we? Okay, so... 
Why have you returned? Uh, I don't know. I'd like to know that as well, honestly. So we got to find another battery. Wait, Bobby? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Breaky noises. We saw this in, in the trailer, though, and he, Bobby was okay. Is it going to be a different Bobby, maybe? There's so much I want to look at. So much I want to look at on my second playthrough. Yeah, why, have you, why have you returned? It's a very good question. I can drop down here, but also what if I go back this way? Is Catnap going to be here now? Wait, this was the picture from the, the trailer. This is, is this um Theodore, I think? I think this is Theodore. AKA Catnap. Is this the only one that's on a an angle like that as well? I think it is. I think it's the only one that's on an angle. Maybe a little little hint there. Okay, I guess we drop back down with the battery. Is uh It's gotten darker, I swear. When I'm still wearing my gas mask for no reason. Hey Kissy, look what I found. Still doesn't care. Still doesn't give a crap. That's fine. Okay, so battery time. <laughs> Cock and do. Right. Daytime, please. Okay, but now that I've returned power, is Kissy still gonna be there? Yeah. Okay. So now that's on, but is this a shortcut, I guess? Or up to the, to the next level? Mm, there's so much to see. It's... Hug it. Come on. Mob, no. This is... Stop it. Stop it. You know what you're doing, Mob. You know what you're doing. Stop it. Stop it. Stop teasing me like this. I'm telling you, Huggy lives. Huggy lives. I've got another call. Tiny old bathroom. Look at that. Be sure to wash your hands. Uh. Oh, look, Poppy. Is that the original Poppy? I doubt it. But Poppy Flower is kind of cool. All right. The Hour of Joy. Go on, Carl. You show that wall who's boss. What was that? <laughs> what was that? Hi there. I'm Piggy Piggy. Let's eat. All right. Roast beef? Delicious. I don't mind about roast beef. Grilled chicken? Down the hatch. It's going to say, it's going to say pork, isn't it? It's going to say pork. Seared elephant? Yum. Played unicorn? Mmm. Still hungry. Hey, what do you say you and I be Friends. Yeah? I don't think I want to be your friend. Hi there. I'm Piggy Piggy. It seems like you eat all your friends. Oh, got another tape. Another tape. More law. Where's the law? Where's the law? Where's the law? Where's the law? Here it is. Give me. What does that say? I can read it in the inventory. What does it say? Samuel Lee's last day. Till he was turned into a toy. Ah, and here they all are. Well, of course. They'd never miss this. Look at Mrs. Brooks. Who's going away? Oh, tell us. Shh, 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 shh. Oh, that's so creepy. This week, Dr. White here has selected our very own Samuel Lee. Yay. They're like celebrating when the kids are being sent now, off to be toys. He goes, let's all give Sam that's one That's so creepy. That is so messed we? up. With me. One, two, three. Goodbye, Sam. That is so messed up. They're like teaching the kids to. They're teaching the kids to celebrate when the other kids are being turned into toys. That is, Playtime Co. You are evil. You are evil. Wait, green hand. Uh, what do I need to power though? 
Oh, it's right there. Again, gamers don't look up. Pixel, you were right. <laughs> you were right. Okay. So now I... Wait. Oh, that closed behind me, though. I need power for this one. What was that? Oh, look. There is a, a bobby. Okay. So many puzzles in this one. I'm very puzzled right now. Can you tell? Can you tell my brain is working too hard? Ah. Ah, it's right here. Is it? Aha, it is. Okay, so if I power this one first. Okay, that opens that door. Oh, it's timed though. Okay. So what if I do... Oh, it's like... Ah, that's the next door. Okay, okay, okay. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. That's fine. We're gonna grab this. And we're gonna run. Because then we can get it through the window. Okay, there's a cat be in that, in that crib. There's a cat be in there. It's kind of creepy. Why do they always pick on cat be? It's so mean. What did Cappy ever do to you? Hi, Bobby. Is Bobby bad? Like, is Bobby gonna yell for catnap? Is it gonna be like an alarm? I, I think so. Should we test it? Should we test it? Let's test it. Bobby. Bobby, why are you watching me? Bobby? Oh! Okay, I think I have to get the battery from it, right? But, like, I can't because it's... Because <laughs> it's... It's following me. Okay. Um. Do I have to sneak up on Bobby to get the. To get the battery? Coming back was a mistake. I know. You keep telling me. Okay. So I've got a vent there. Wait. So this is, this is the kid that uh, was friends with mommy. So I guess this was like Marie's friend. Not mommy. Sorry. Kissy. Ignore everything that I just said. It's Kissy's friend, not Mommy's. This is a kitchen. Oh no, it's like a... There's like hospital beds. I think there's like hospital beds. Yeah, look. For the sick kids. Again, did they start maybe? Is that how like... Is that how the process of turning the children into toys started? They started with the sick ones. And then later on, they decided just to put anybody, you know, that like disagreed with them. Like most things, it started off with like a really good intention, but it turned into something much more sinister. I think that's what, I think that's what they're hinting here. Okay, I don't really want to drop down yet though. Like, this one feels so much more open than chapter one and two, honestly, which is not a bad thing, but it does mean that I have like a lot of things I want to. Okay, so he's watching me there. Can I go on this way? Can I sneak up on him? I stole your battery. What do I, <laughs> what do I do with it? I'm slightly nervous being in the vents after what happened in chapter one. So look at that little huggy, right? Yes, yes, spooky music. Where does the battery go? Where does the battery go? So, in here? Aha! I need another one though. This music is so eerie and I don't know why. Okay, let's open that. There we go. Now that shortcut is opened. Hi, Huggy. Wait, look, this, this kid clearly loved Huggy. Do you think this was the uh, room of the, of the, of the Huggy? Do you think this is his room? He loved Huggy so much. Hmm. 
Maybe. Just probably some clues in there we'll have to look for later. So there's Hoggy's room. Hide, hide, hide. Help. God, I can only imagine what happened here when uh, the Hour of Joy happened. Okay, okay. Choose carefully. Take your time and make the choice that feels right for you. Your first toy lasts a lifetime. Yeah, see, they're choosing... They're choosing the toy that they identify with. And then... Yeah, that's the one that they're going to be bonded to, I guess. That's... Oofed. Oofed. All employees should adhere to the recommended four to five hours of sleep before work. Four to five hours of sleep before work? No, that's not enough. That's not enough. That's not enough. You need eight. Come on now. Come on now, Playtime Co. You need eight. I get like four. It's terrible. Okay, I really want to get in here. So we need two. I need two. Uh... Oh, wait, that's closed again. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All right, e easy puzzle, easy puzzle, easy puzzle. All right, we do that. We go boom. All right, then we do that. And then we go boom. And then we go back here and we do that. And we go boom. Sweet. Oh! Canap! No. It's a little one though. You little git. You did that on purpose. Didn't you? Look, it's it's dead. Look at it. You did that on purpose. Bubba. Okay. I want to listen to Huggy's Huggy's uh thing. Hug a day keeps the monsters away. Sure. Two hugs a day is better in every way. Sure. Hugging forever. Hugs are non-stop. Yeah? I'm gonna hug you until you pop. Uh-huh. <laughs> hug a day. See, man, I'm telling you. I am telling you. Huggy's not done. Like, why would they put this in here? And make him all sinister sounding and saying he's gonna hug us if he's not coming back. I'm telling you, I, I, uh, I'm telling you, man, I feel it in my bones. I feel it in my bones that Huggy's coming back. And he's gonna be like more twisted and more damaged and he's gonna be creepy. I'm telling you it's happening, okay? Now, Carl, do your job. Wait. Gotta do two hands. Why does it sound like it laughs when it does it? it sound like it's laughing. Two hugs a day is better than ever. Two hugs a day. Two huggies? Maybe? Maybe? Also, catnap plush? Adorable, by the way. I like I like mine. He's kind of cute. Wait. He's moving. <laughs> Get out of here, Bubba. Right. Can't play the music. Well, that's scary. Is that Poppy? Is that supposed to be Poppy with the bow? Or I don't, I don't, I don't know. Oh, <laughs> look at it. It looks angry. Whatever it is. There's Catnap. God, these kids are messed up. Quick. Way oh so the vents were where they were pumping the gas through that makes sense to send the kids to sleep this kid was very neat and organized oh hello all right catnap I'm not gonna lie so far catnap seems too friendly like there's something there's something not quite right. Like, he's like Huggy. Why is he not attacking, you know? Yeah, look, they pumped the gas in. And then they were watching. Every single room has a, a two-way mirror. 
Because look, you couldn't see that. If you go back in, if you go back in, you can't see it. It's just a wall. That's, was it a mirror? Oh, that's creepy. Wait, how's that physically possible? <laughs> how is that physically possible? Uh, sure. Uh, yeah. Um, Playtime Co. Ingenious new invention. Magical wallpaper. But still, that's a creepy touch. It's a very creepy touch. Okay, cool. So... Cool, I can take this off. Oh, there's another battery. Yeah, this this chapter definitely feels much more maze-like than chapter one and chapter two. I feel like I never really got lost in the first two chapters, but this one, there's a lot more ways to explore, which is definitely a good thing. I'm, I'm not complaining at all. But it does mean that my things you might have missed video is going to be a little bit more tricky to make because <laughs> this is going to take me days to look through, I think. This is going to take me days and days, but that's fine. Okay, so all the doors open now? Yeah, okay, all the doors are open now. Sweet. Now we can properly explore. Uh, don't worry about the fires that we've caused everywhere. Don't worry about that. It's fine. We'll call the fire brigade later. We'll call the uh, flippy fireman. Hey, it's the hand cannon. Okay. I actually have a whole theory about this, um, which I was going to make before they dropped the, the trailer on us, but I have a whole theory about Playtime Co. Maybe not just making toys anymore. Hint, hint. Weapons. Uh, I wasn't... Oh, nope. That's that's not what I need to do. Okay, so we aim the turret. Got to use both hands. Okay, we got to use both hands. All right. So I've got to keep a hold of it. This is tricky. This is this is actually tricky. Okay, cool. All right, I did it. I did it. I did it. Look at that. That was actually a pretty fun puzzle. But I've got music now. I want to listen to it. Where's this music coming from? It's coming from the ceiling. Okay. Okay. Do we have any new loot? Shh. <sighs> That's actually cheeky. Because every single Poppy Playtime chapter so far has had a, a vent hiss. And I said, every chapter gets one. This is your one you're allowed. This is the one you're allowed, mob. No more now. No more. But yeah, I wonder if that is a reference to the, <laughs> to the other two. In the other two chapters. That'd be funny. That'd be funny if it is. Well, press the button. Wait. Oh, it's an elevator. But it looks like there's something in here. I want to get it. I want to get in here. There's loot in there. There's loot. Let me get the loot. Fine. Fine. Be that way. Don't let me get any loot. And we're back at the beginning now. We're back at the. Yeah. Did we do it? Did we win? Did we win home sweet home? I think we did. I think we won. Okay. I'm, I guarantee there are some stuff that I missed in this area. So when I go back on my second playthrough and, and really deep dive into it, I'll have to bring you a video, but I bet you, I bet you is this stuff. That was such a big area. There was so many places I could have, I could have gone. So keep an eye out, I guess. Subscribe. Oh, hello. Kissy. Come on now. here to help <sighs> this place makes her tense i'm glad that ollie could help you get this far 
Okay, hey, who's Ollie? We found you at all. <sighs> okay, so Kissy's listening to Poppy. Looks like the train crash hurt us both. You've been through so much. Don't think I've forgotten your little betrayal. You deserve an explanation. Yes, I think Come. I do. I think I do. She sounds so we'll heavy, by okay. the way. We'll be okay. Because we had this whole debate in chapter one where Huggy like didn't seem that strong, but yet he could he could bust down through that metal door so easily. I think it's because they have like a metal skeleton. All right, but listen, I'm still sus of Poppy, okay? I'm sus of Poppy and I'm sus of you, Kissy, now. Just saying. Listen, oh, look, she looks so I'm sad. I'm not your enemy, but I can't just let you leave. Okay. That sounds like what my enemy would say. Is bigger than all of us. And I need you. So we can get revenge on those monsters who've tortured you. Who've tortured us. They didn't act alone. They're disciples of the original. The prototype. But the honors. I'm so confused. Are these guys ex staff? <laughs> oh, kissy. Are these guys ex staff? She looks kind of nervous, honestly. Those animations are 10 out of 10. I still don't trust you. I don't. I'm sorry. I don't trust you. I don't trust you one little bit, to be honest. But all right. Push the big red button. Daytime. Nighttime. Daytime. Nighttime. Oh, look, a poppy door, huh? Daytime. Nighttime. Sorry. Um, can I get through that door? Can I get through? No. All right, well, I pressed the big red button. Why not? Now what? Should I press it again? I get back on the lift. Okay. The prototype knows we're coming by now. You try to escape, he'll kill you before you ever reach that front door. He's the reason I was trapped in that god awful case for so long. You yes, the prototype. No idea. Put her in there, but did he use a smiley, Chris? Let me help you kill him. Let me help you save everyone. We've all seen you. How capable you are. Mm -hmm. You killed Huggy. You killed Mommy. Mm -hmm. You freed me. You are perfect for this. Catnap is coming. He's the final obstacle the prototype has placed against us. We can't stay here. Keep yourself safe. Ollie will call you. Mm-hmm. All right. I'll trust you, you little, you little doll, you little doll, dude. Hey, hey, it's me again. It seems like Poppy explained everything now, and she turned on the dome's backup power. Now the plan from here is pretty simple. We need to restore power to the gas production zone. First, go back to the home sweet home building you were just in. You should be able to find a big power cord somewhere around the porch. Grab it and plug it in underneath the statue. See, these three seem to have a lot of knowledge of the inner workings of this factory. Almost like, again, you know, they could be staff. And it sounds like right now, again, remember that mommy didn't like the staff and we killed mommy right 1006 is on the side of the toys from what we can tell so i think we're helping the staff right now i don't think we're doing the right thing what what is beeping what do i need to oh this whoa where am i putting it oh <laughs> whoa, whoa, wait where am i plugging it i was too busy theorizing where do i need to put it uh Oh, I 
here, beeps. It's in here, right? Yeah? Oh. Oh no, I lost it! No! <laughs> oh, god damn it. Home sweet home? There we go. Yeah. Was a backup generator for just that building. And every building should have one. Now you've just taken Home Sweet Home's backup power and routed it here. We're already halfway done. Hmm. But where to go next? Everywhere is pretty dangerous. I don't know, man. I'm still sus. That playhouse especially. Yuck. Is that especially? So Oh yeah, I wonder why. Thanks, I already got it, but thanks. Alright, let's, let's, let's go back to school. So, from the trailer, spoilers, there's a character in the school I'm very interested to find out. I'm very interested to find out who this is. Let's go. Also, are these, were these alive? Who knows? Can I get in? Yep, there we go. Hello, Bron. Wait, wait, wait! There was uh, spoilers! I went to look at that. I went to look at the... Who is that? Oh my god, is this the one we saw in the trailer? I think it might be. It's like a teacher. Pay attention, do your homework, play fair, respect authority. Stay in your seat until the bell is rung. I think this is I think this is what we can see moving. Miss Delight. School rules. Miss Delight. But that's a human. That's not a that's not an animal. I guess to be fair, neither, neither are Huggy or Kissy. They're not really animals either. Okay, make this quick. Turn on the generator, leave, and plug the school's power cord into the center. Be careful in there. I don't think I can connect to you on that side of the dome. Not our friend, I guess you're about to say. Cool. Can't wait. I actually can't. I can't wait to meet them. I want to see who they are. This is Miss Delight speaking. Miss Delight. Please excuse the interruption. Students, remain in your seat until the bell has rung. And no going in the halls without a hall pass. I actually kind of play the piano. Oh, there's a note here. Can I pick it up? Oh, I can't pick it up. Okay, I was trying to read it. <laughs> I can actually pick it up. Can I read it though? Just a few weeks ago now was the hour of joy. Today there is only silence in this school. I don't think any of us here know what to do with it. The hallways without the children carry even the smallest sounds as if they were shouts. The other teachers and I startle each other constantly. We'll have to get used to it. Something locked the front door this morning. We haven't been able to open it. So this was after the hour. This was after the downfall of the factory, but they didn't kill the staff straight away. That's... Okay. Interesting. Help? Yeah, I, I can't. <laughs> I can't help right now. I think, I think, I think, I think you're all dead. Joy, reading is fun. What's going on here? Yeah, looks so they they made like a a bed. They were sleeping here for a while, I guess, considering that they were stuck here. They were just trying to survive and, like, do the best that they could with what they had. Interesting. I have a feeling, and this is just a feeling, but I have a feeling that Miss Delight might be a fun favorite. I just have a, I, yeah, I just have a little, I have a little inkling, you know? We'll see. I thought it could be catnap. Not catnap, cat bee, sorry. But fun. Yeah, I bet. I bet it's fun. Again, I'm really liking the openness of this one. You can just kind of kind of go anywhere. 
Yeah, I really am going to have to dig through this, aren't I? Wait, look. Was this, was this from, um, when we dropped Huggy? There's Huggy, and then there's look what looks like a dead Huggy. We'll see. We'll see. All right, we got battery. Oh, another note. Th these notes are really hard to see. Um, I've got to really keep my eyes peeled. Okay, note two. I heard a knock at the door today. I heard it breathing. Whatever it was, it wouldn't speak when called out to. I spent hours after it. I spent hours after it went silent, wondering if this was what locked us in here. I've made a weapon of sorts, pencils and rulers and tape and twine. I've taken to calling it Bob. It's crude, but if that door opens, I need to be ready. Oof. I don't think that's gonna... I don't think that's gonna help you, though. Stab the giant toy with a with a pencils. I don't think that's gonna work. So we can duck down to there. Okay, this is where we gotta put the battery. We need that one in there too. All right, let's go grab that battery. There's a science corridor from the trailer. Again, spoilers. Give me that. Good old candy cat. Right, let's go put this in here. Gonna get that other one out. How are we gonna do that? Oh! <laughs> What's she called? Miss Delight? She creepy looking. Wait! I recognize you! You do? Yes! I remember! You used to work here! Apparently so. for your co-workers. Bob? Catnap wouldn't like that you're here. You should leave. For your own safety. Wait! So this was the teacher that used the... the... She turned the, the things into a weapon and called it Bob. Okay, so it was Miss Delight that wrote that note. Interesting. There's another huggy. Why are there so many huggies? So many. Yeah, I need another battery though. Oh, tape, 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 law. Yellow tape. What's this tape? Uh. Can I not? Oh, took a second to load in. Illegible writing. Okay. Well. Where's the television? I need to. I need to watch it. Oh. Another note. Wait, is it? Yeah, another note. All right, let's read this. Uh, note three. No food for days. The others argued with me over what was left. They started glaring, judging. They blocked the kitchen doorway with their bodies. I think they've singled me out to die first. Oh no. So was this before she was put into the doll body or? I don't, I don't know. Because as far as I'm aware, the dolls don't need sustenance. Also, is this tar? This looks like tar. This is a, um, this is a new theory that we have to look out for. Something that fake Fox talked about. We have to, we have to look out for the tar. Uh, wait, do I have to go up in this vent? Ah, once again. Gamers don't look up. <laughs> I swear to God. You'd think I'd learn my lesson by now. Um, but no. No, I'm I'm still um, complete trash. Yeah, I'm learning lessons about myself today. And one is that I'm too lazy to look up in video games. And I think that mobs should have realized this. That I'm too lazy to look up in video games. And should have accommodated me. And not put things in the ceiling. Um, I'm kidding, but there we go. Right. Wait, 
Oh, I think it was a. I think that was just a message. <laughs> that was a VHS tape. <laughs> I thought there was a VHS tape on there for a second. All right. Well, we've got another VHS to watch. I've got the yellow VHS. Is that Bob? Where are the kids? Oh, please, don't go away. Children safe? Who's talking? Yes. Oh, can I see them? No. And that was it. That's all he'd tell me. <laughs> She's talking to one zero zero six. I think. I think Mr. Light might have lost the plot. Uh, why would you kill them all, though? Why would why would you? That's so weird that you'd turn around like that. Hey, look, Bonzo. And a dead Bonzo. Again, is that from chapter two? Is that... Yes, yes, the hour of joy. So many locked doors. I wanna I wanna enter. Let me in. Let me in. Okay, I gotta find another battery. I'm getting very hungry. Oh, this looks suspicious. This looks suspicious. Wait, Bonzo. Oh, look, Bonzo was the clue. The Bonzo with the note on, with the giant bright light on the ceiling. Uh, note four, here we go. The pit in me howls for food. Yes, same. I can't think about anything other than how hungry I am. Also same. Hardly have the strength now to pick myself off the floor. Bob speaks to me though. She gives me strength. I found that if I stand still, completely still, everyone thinks I'm dead. Bob says I need to eat and that the other teachers would never see me coming. Anything to stop the howling. So they are starving, so they started eating each other. Okay. Well, again, that does make sense. They were locked down here with no food. But then again, it says that 1006 didn't require sustenance. So is it that they didn't need to eat? They just felt like they did? Like the hunger was sending them crazy, even though they didn't really need to eat, maybe? Or are they different? I don't, I don't know. But yeah, I find it interesting that 1006 was required, was, was stated specifically not to need sustenance. Okay, come on. That looks like Hoggy. That looks like Hoggy. You're killing me. Mob, you are killing me. Everything, Hoggy's everywhere. Or is it just Paradoilia again? Um... <laughs> <laughs> Let me get over there. Again, I've got I've got two rooms I can drop down. I kind of want to drop down into that one. Oh, I actually can't drop down that one. Okay, cool. Look, it looks like Huggy. Not a good listener, are you? No. You're a lot like the other humans in that way. Yeah. I wonder if your screams will sound like theirs too. No. <laughs> Nah. I look forward to finding out. No. Nah, it's all right. How's about instead, right? You give me what I need and then I'll leave and me and Hoggy will go and have our little reunion. It'll be great. Okay, so now I'm in here, but what is that? Oh, okay. Yeah. Now I have the power. Unlimited power. More like very limited power quite actually quite limited power okay i quite like the design i'm not gonna lie i know twitter's gonna have a field day with this one hello students find my sisters and i to learn facts across a variety of subjects press my button to hear some facts on anatomy Okay. Did you know that there are 60,000 miles of blood vessels in the human body? For comparison, the Earth around the equator is almost 25,000 miles. I... Not to sound like a flat earther or anything. But part of me wants to dispute this fact. 
like if you were to lay out uh, we're not that dense right like i don't i don't think this is entirely true i listen listen scientists sorry if you're like if you're like reading reading the yeah if you're reading the video if you're watching the video right now and you're like oh my god you're so dumb this is so true uh sorry but it just sounds so fake okay that is one of those facts that sounds fake to me in my head the smallest bone in your body is the states in your ear still damage it and you risk losing your hearing see that that sounds like a believable fact want to learn more about human organs yes please Pay close attention in class organs pie are we going to talk about organs pie maybe also she's got an apple on her thing she's talking about organs just just putting that in there it's like a heart i had to what did you have to do oh no no number five I'm so sorry I had to eat. I had to survive. I ate them. I had to. I had to. I had to. I had to. You didn't have to, though. Like, you didn't really have to. Could have died. I think there's a puzzle, but I can't see. It's a bit dark. I mean, that helps a little bit, but... What do I... What do I shoot? Do I shoot this? Oh, it was right there. Oh, oh no. Ah. Don't break it. Ah, wait, wait. So she can only move in the, ah, she can only move in the, in the light, in the, yeah, no, in the dark. She can only move in the dark. Oh my God, you son of a. <laughs> she looks so creepy. Don't be, so oh, so there are death screens, but only when you get grabbed. Don't be selfish. Get up. Okay. Whew. That was, um, that was something. But again, she looks like a human doll. I guess Poppy's a human. I, this whole time, yeah, I guess Poppy's a human. Wait, why is there tense music right now? Is she active now? Is she hunting? It's like phasmophobia. I think I still need to do the the puzzle though, don't I? There we go. She's so cool looking. Is she, oh, that's Bob. She's got Bob. Okay. Take the battery. Okay, I'm just gonna run. I think I need to run. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, no. Okay. Listen. You, you and Bob, leave me out of this, okay? I'm not in, I'm not interested. She's so fast. Oh, sugar balls. Um, I don't know what I just said. Ig oh, God. Well, yeah, we're gonna. She's so creepy looking. Look at her mouth. She's so freaky. I, uh... You don't get to die yet. Get up. I'm gonna put that in there. You leave me alone. But we need the electricity, don't we? From the... From where was it again? Oh, you son of a... I'm trying to... <laughs> I was trying to aim. God damn. Don't be selfish. Grab the, grab the battery. Right, let's go. No hesitation. I'm gonna go through the door. We gotta grab the thing. Okay, so that was much quicker. There we go. And then, are we okay now? Nope, nope, still dark. Oh, God. I don't know where she is. Run, I'm trying. I'm trying. I honestly, like, is this new areas? I can't, oh, sh sugar. 
Oh, wait, can we juke her now, though? Because... Yeah, look, come through this way. Come through this way. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now we go around here. Hi, mommy. I need the, um... Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> Help! I need an adult! Oh, god damn. Seriously, where is it? She's hot on my tail. And I have no clue... Snack. Come in here, come in here. Sure in. God. Bin, I agree. Get in the bin. Oh nice. It's not gonna it's just not gonna work. I need I need another She's so fast! Leave me alone! I don't think this one's going to work either. I think it's too far away. Oh my god, it just worked! Okay. Okay. Okay, well that door opened. Uh, we got to get two. Let me, let me, let me. Wait, I can hear her. Where, where is she? Oh, well, that worked. Oh, come on now. Come, no. This is, this is unfair. Dude, <laughs> I'm locked in. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? You evil woman. Where do I, where do I put it? No, you stand back. You, you stop it. You stop it. Can I lock her in here actually? Yeah, yeah, come right back here, come right back here. Get locked in! Yes. I have, wait, she's gonna, oh, she's gonna break the door down. Oh, stop it. Stop it. All right. All right, I've got power for some reason. I... I kind of need you, I kind of need you to stay where you are. You know what I mean? Oh, I got caught. I got caught on the wall. I got caught on the wall. I didn't mean it. It was just a joke. But now she's going to break that down, right? So I can... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can get in there more quickly. I tried. I tried. I tried. Okay. Oh, I missed. Oh, stuck. It's stuck. It's stuck. It's stuck. I'm trying to speed run this. No. Get the get the battery. Put the battery in the thing. What's she looking at the door for? Okay, we go. I'm gonna go in here. Oh, we're trying Juka. We're trying Juka. Yeah, yeah. Come over here. Sweet, sweet. Now we run. Oh, no, my hands. Okay. Oh, ah, wait. You son of a... She's so fast. Okay, okay. Run! Oh my god. 
tense. Too tense. It's too tense. I'm trying to look for secrets. I'm trying to look for the secrets. Wait. Oh, we mommy, mommy long legged her. Oh no. We, mo we mommied her. Good old mouth. Oh. Yeah, look, she's like a, like a doll from Resident Evil. Look at her, look at her. Oh, weird. Well, that was uh, exciting, wasn't it? Um, <laughs> stressed. I'm stressed. Want to try hopping to the moon with me? Yeah, at this point, yeah. Let's go. On three with me. Okay. One, two, three. I did it. <laughs> Didn't get very far, did we? No, but we tried though. Again. One, two, three. Nope. Still didn't make it. Listen, this won't stop until we make it to the moon. One, two. No, oh, no. Don't look at your feet. Nothing I wasn't... matters. Again. Again. It's getting very stressed. Jump. Jump. <laughs> okay. I'm Hoppy Hopscotch. Well, we tried. Hey, we got the flag on now. Right, okay. So this is... We're going to have to use this to, to keep the enemies away. But we only have limited ammo. So we got to be careful. Look at these caves. They're so huge. Like, how did they even... I guess they must have found these caves naturally and built around them, obviously. Like, we know that the company builds the underground section, but holy crap, this is so dangerous. You stupid, clucky elevator. What was that, Richie? Nothing, nothing. Let's just get this shipment dropped and go. I take it you're not a fan of this place, are you? Nope. Never liked the feel of it. I mean, don't you think these kids deserve some real sunlight? Right, I, I agree. Lights and painted skies? Hell, we're not even allowed to talk to these kids. Isn't that... <clears throat> <sighs> Sorry, Stu. Sorry? <laughs> Oh wait, wasn't Rich the one that got demoted down to the rejected toys area or something? I can't remember. He was the guy in chapter one. Worked in the uh, factory part in chapter one. Honest to a fault, but uh, I always liked that about you. Yeah, <laughs> well, you're one of the few. You know, Richie, with my retirement coming up. Oh, it's uh, his last day before retirement. They've been pushing hard for me to choose my replacement. I'm thinking about giving the role to you. But, uh, really? Yeah, what role, though? Really? Nothing official yet. But I think there's a decent guy beneath all that graph. And honestly, Hardworking man. You prove me right. I said your chances are pretty good. Wow. I, uh, geez, I don't know what to say. I, I'm just glad to see not everyone in this place has it out for me. Not everybody, Rich. Not everybody. What role, though? Interesting. See, this is exceedingly dangerous for staff to get around. Like, I wonder how, again, maybe this is why they had so many lawsuits because people were dying to stuff like this. Look at how dangerous this is. I bet there's a bunch of dead people. <laughs> oh, <laughs> do, do you see what I mean? <laughs> I'd be the first to die. First day on the job. 
died to poor parkour. Look at it, it's falling to bits. Again, no wonder people are dying, man. This is trash. Oh, 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 I'm on a timer. I'm on a timer. Did not realize. Sorry, game. Sorry, 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 sorry. Didn't realize I had limited time. I do like, though, I do like that they've given us this giant underground area now because it means that the factory can be much bigger than it should have been. So it means they can do more areas in future chapters and whatnot, which, you know, smart, I guess. But yeah, I didn't realize the scale of the construction here is, 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 is very big. It's very, it's very big. Or I guess I could just do this. Yeah, there we go. Again, it seems like such a such a dumb way for the employees to get around. Like, it, you know what I mean? Like, it seems like such an unnecessary level of just to operate an elevator. Like, there's got to be a reason for this, right? Like, it's got to be some sort of like to stop people getting in the wrong areas, or because Leith Pierre's crazy. I don't know. It just seems really weird to have this such an elaborate setup for what could have just been a switch. Wait. That music sounds familiar. Why are we getting spooky music? Oh, oh! <laughs> That's why. Oh, this is here. The shrine thing. With the with the guy. I'll try and zoom in a little bit for you, but like, yeah, this was in the trailer. Why is this here in the caverns? That is so weird. I thought it was gonna be in the play care. Alright, well on that note, this looks like a good place to eat. Basitsuki, you need to get out of this place. You need to live. You and Poppy could fix this. End this madness. The torment. Oh no. Oh no. Leave me. Oh. <laughs> Please, just 